I'm John Horner of the LA Times. I'm Steve Zeichen with the LA Times. So it's finally started to snow. Will a Sundance sale be far behind? <laughs> yeah, it's not quite a blizzard of, of deals yet. You know, one movie that's gotten a lot of attention after screening earlier today that you saw and I think liked is this Drake Doremus film like crazy. Tell us about it. Uh, Drake Doremus was here last year with a movie called Douchebag. It was a very small mumblecore movie that uh, didn't attract a lot of attention. This is a much bigger production. It's a romantic comedy starring Anton Yelchin and Felicity Jones. It's a young couple falling in and out of love over the course of a long-distance relationship. Incredibly well-made, sweet, original story you might have seen 50, 100 times but told in a completely new way. Is it an awards movie if, you know, kind of based on the performances or is it more of a crowd-pleasing kind of tearjerker type of film? It's not a tearjerker, it's crowd-pleaser. The question is, can it play to teens or is it an art movie? I, I thought it was very good. I think a lot of buyers are going to warm to it as well. It feels like it's right on the bubble of being kind of a bigger a bigger sell. Another movie that may kind of cross into that territory but hasn't gotten there yet is this movie Margin Call. We both saw it yesterday. Right. A Wall Street movie about the collapse, not quite Wall Street money never sleeps, a much more intimate character study. It's not a thriller. No right. one's committing any crimes or at least any crimes are getting no. sent to jail from. I, I think the, the movie reminds me most of David Mamet and Glenn Gary, Glenn yep. Ross. Incredible uh, writing by the screenwriter and director, J.C. Chandor. Some great performances in it. I think the buyers are saying, do people want to go see another movie about Wall Street? Even Inside Job, incredibly acclaimed documentary, didn't do any business. So I think that's the hurdle for them. Well, and I talked to Chandor after the film, and one of his points was the studios who wanted to make it at a much higher budget than he ended up making it for said they want, you know, either a big sex scene or a big dramatic, you know, prison showdown. <laughs> they wanted this to be a bigger movie, and it's not it's just a small intimate right. character study. I think that's the strength of the film, but it's going to work against it on the distribution front. I agree. I think it's what makes it a good movie, but may limit its sales. I'm John Horn of the LA Times. I'm Steve Zajic. We'll see you next time.